With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, so our question is we are having the phenol which reacts with the CSCLC in presence of the base KOH. Then we have to find what will be the product. If we talk about the mechanism, so what happens? We are having the CSCL3 and here we are having the base that is OH minus. It abstracts the proton from here and there will be a release of this chloride ion from here. So from here what we can see that there will be a formation of the carbene which is an electron deficient species having a, a neutral carbon with a valence of 2 and 2 unshared valence electrons. Now what happens here? We are having the OH phenol. So we are having the phenol. It is like this. Now what happens here? It is acting as a acid. What happens? It just releases this acidic proton and it becomes the phenoxide ion that is O minus attached with the benzene. Now what happens? It is a good electron donating group. What happens? It just increases the electron density at the ortho position. And here we are having the electron deficient carbene which is being attacked by this electron density at the ortho position on this carbene. And what happens? There will be a formation of the, here it will be uh, C, Cl, it will have minus 10 because here the electron density has been increased. It will be double bond O. Now what happens here in order to regain its aromaticity, there will be a release of this proton. And what happens? The proton will get attacked by this C minus. Here it will be CH. Now what happens here? There will be a release of the chloride ion and here it will have electron deficient uh, carbon. What happens? We are having the OH group which will attack here. And from here what we can say that there will be a formation of the, here it will be O minus. Here it will be C, it will be OH, Cl, and here it will be H. Now what happens further? On again reaction with the KOH, there will be a formation of the compound which is attached with OH and here at the ortho position, we are having the CHO. So if you try to write its name, its name is orthohydroxybenzaldehyde, which is also known as salicaldehyde. So from here we can say that our third option is correct. I hope you got this concept. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.